If you could stop your pathetic, morose navel gazing for one minute, you might see that we have more serious problems to contend with, such as the landlord that we mutually suffer beneath. That's right, I'm talking about the anti-vibe. He's a terrible, terrible, terrible man. He's awful, and if you see him, you've got to stop him. He's one of those, but bigger and meaner. And he walks around the halls all fucking self-important, like he's important or something. And he says important things like, don't put thumbtacks in the walls, or you'll be out in the street. I'm an anal retentive control freak, and I like to keep things neat. Oh, I hate that guy. I hate that guy. <laughs> So smart, I could have been a physician, but I choose to make a living out of ripping off musicians. So I built the sweaty palace in the middle of a slum. I charge a lot of money, but the idiots still come. So I pack them all into tiny, lifeless cubicles. While I sit around and polish my cubicles. <laughs> And savvy and a criminal Cause writing rules a business boy And I know that for sure 